Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a minute. It definitely has been a minute. For archival purposes, we are streaming today at 720p. It is a 6,500 bit rate. And it is currently 10 minutes past 9 a.m. on the 24th of April. 2022 and it's Sunday today is going to be a pretty chill one pretty quiet pretty uh, reserved g'day wingers how you doing Just doing a mosey. Having a bit of a mosey session. Taking our time with things. Gonna be heading up into tall trees today. Got our camp set up here for a little bit. Gonna head up for a bit of adventure. <laughs> Might catch some fish, bring something back for crypts, maybe a snack or two back for Dagwood here. Hopefully get everything underway. You love Red Dead 2 wingers, haven't played in a while. Well, now's as good a time as any really. They're not updating it. <laughs> they haven't done it in a while. Come on fella, let's give you a pat. Oh, it's been raining too. You playing in the water buddy. going to sync up the mic. Well, oh, maybe we'll not be sitting out here. Hang out in the tent for a second. I'll be back in just a moment. Now you don't have anybody to mosey with for for life reasons, wingers. That's understandable, buddy. We'll have to um we'll have to go on and do some uh do some some missions and some some hunting and stuff at some point in the near future for sure. For sure, for sure. But today I haven't streamed in a little while. Oh, big storm coming in. Alright, I'm just listening. Now I know you've got your fingers in a few other pies now, and that's fine. 
Just don't forget to make time for our business too. I will, Crips. Don't worry, that's kind of the goal of today. That rain. Honestly, hunting is one of the most enjoyable things to do. I, I wholeheartedly agree. Sometimes I just go out looking for the perfect hunt. Perfect, uh, the perfect critter. Sometimes I don't find it, but... Let's make a good stew here. You have a restaurant quality stew. Alright. I see how it is, Crips. Let's munch this up real quick. Whoa! Gotta love a good thunderstorm. G'day, Snorf. How are you, my friend? Just listen to it. Hello, buddy. Yes, I know. I know, I know. You soggy motherfucker. You kinda shitty. How come? What's going on? I think the storm's let up, buddy. Yeah. You and your girlfriend broke up. That is the unfortunate... Unfortunate, uh... Part of things. It hurts. It sucks. Sometimes... The silver lining is that there's... More adventures around the corner that you, uh, didn't even know were there. I don't really have a ton to offer you today, I'm sorry. As far as con uh, consolations are concerned. But Wingers does. Thank you for the gift sub to Snorf, Wingers. Enjoy, Snorf. It hurts worse because there's literally nothing that you could have done. If there's nothing that you could have done, then it was inevitable. It was something that was unavoidable. Don't take it to heart. Because, if anything, that means it wasn't you. Let's make some split point bullets while we're here. We'll stock up if we're going to go out hunting. You're not? You're glad for both of you? It just sucks? Yeah, man. Yeah. It's not generally a happy thing to have happen. Yeah, you two have actually been through uh, similar situations somewhat recently. Interesting how the world works like that. She realized that she was gay, so she would have been living a lie if she stayed. Yeah. Probably a good thing not to have uh, held on to that one. Robbers, just in the last week, 
I thought that was a dying art, uh, no pun intended. Let's make something for Mercy in case we need to run. Make a bit of horse stimulant. These are still friends, but fuck. Yeah. Yeah, it shakes it shakes life up a bit for sure. Upsets the apple cart, so to speak. Hi there. I assume uh, Miss Fikes keeping you busy. What happens between me and my moonshine shack is no business of yours, Crips. stuff at the campfire do you daily all right then I'll make it quick Yeah, that goes for me as well, Snorf. We're all here if you need anybody to chat with. And that's what that extra channel in the Discord's for as well. Anybody that plays Silly Buggers in there, I don't have... I don't have the patience to... deal with, so they'll just swiftly be... Uh, <laughs> well, dealt with, I guess. Out of big game, or am I just out of mint? I'm just out of mint. Okay. I'll cook up a little bit of plain pork then. But today is not going to be particularly full on, Snorf. Just so you know. Not gonna be uh whatever that Maggie Fike's been saying about me is all lies. Maggie doesn't talk to, talk about you at all. Everyone's talking about ex-girlfriends today. Crips here is just still holding on. Now we got a shopping list from uh a good friend Madame Nazar. Take those fire arrows too, thank you very much. Shotgun slugs, yes please. More fire arrows. Peaches? A bolus. Rifle cartridges, because we just made those split points. Okay. Nope, don't want the map. Let's see what that collection is. I've already got three or three. Looking for three unlucky cards. Find all items. Two of cups, two of pentacles, and a two of swords. Good shit. Well, I think our nearest post office is probably Strawberry, but that's not where we're headed today. We might have time at the end, but uh, in the short term. See you later, buddy.
All right, one more pat. Come on. I'll give you one more pat. While I'm gone, the bed's all yours, all right? Yeah? You can sleep inside the tent. You tell Crips he's not allowed to. If I come back and he's dead and you're not, that's totally cool. But if it's the other way around, I'll kill him. Yeah, I'm saying that loud enough for you to hear me. Oh, messy. Let's settle up. How was that rain for you last night? You get a bit soggy, hey? Bit soggy? I'll give you a bit of a brush. Good girl. Boy? Girl. Fuck, I always forget with you until I see if you've got a big set of swinging nuts. Also, did that fucking stew from last night already wear out? Uh, you can come back to the camp. With me. Such a beautiful game, even better in 4K HDR. Oh my god, it's lush. Yeah, yeah, I don't have an HDR TV. Um, and it still doesn't have a, uh... A next gen update, a graphical update. But running this on a Series X, it's gorgeous. And it's it's beautiful to look at. The countryside's gorgeous. The countryside is gorgeous. You wait right there, Mercy. The countryside's gorgeous and it is a combination of the sound and how the world feels alive and just so many things that just make this game Amazing. G'day, Sarvain. How you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. You're here just in time. We're just on our way out. Heading out the gate. It's currently 26 minutes past 12 for you, wingers. That's pretty late. That's pretty late. Ooh. Can we grab these? I'm gonna grab these golden currents, Mercy. Yeah, give me them. Good shit. That's what I trained you for. Ooh, a bit warmer today. The fog's out. After that big storm last night. You're doing great? Awesome. Awesome. How am I doing? Uh, I'm coming to the tail end of my day. I've been awake for a long time. I haven't streamed in a minute. So I decided to... Uh, decided to... Come in for a bit of a stream today and... Uh, do a bit of a mosey. Which is usually just a peaceful... Peaceful Red Dead stream. Bit of cruising around. Bit of foraging. Maybe the odd gunfight or two, but we try to keep it down. Because this particular playlist on YouTube is uh, mostly used by people trying to sleep. Which is what we try and keep it to. So we try and keep the gunshots to a minimum. So we're going to be using the bow predominantly today. Ooh, turkeys. Ooh, big old deer. Was that a moose? I don't even know. What is it? Bull elk. Hmm. He's a way off. You guys let me know if I'm too quiet or anything like that. Like, obviously, it is a little bit more quiet today, but... I still want to keep the balance in check. Oh, you're so well trained, Mercy. Such a good girl. Boy? Boy, girl? You know what? I'm going to double check it. I'm going to double check it right now.
Hold on. Wait. Yeah, there we go. Boy. Good boy. Okay. You're a boy until I forget again. supposed to be an outpost around here somewhere. We might head this way and hope we come across it. If we don't, then we uh, might just find somewhere nice to go and do a bit of fishing. A bit of fishing. A bit of uh, peaceful relaxing. Try and stay out of other people's hair. I do remember that one day. I was doing a nice, peaceful, mosey stream, and, uh... Had some outlaws rock up on us. And it didn't matter where I went in the world, or how I got there. They always found a way to track me down. So I slaughtered them. As you do. Because how else does one deal with outlaws? If there are those that are hell-bent on our destruction. Then we give them the opportunity to run. And if that doesn't work, if they choose violence. Speaking of choosing violence. Oh shit. I can hear that. This will be one of the one of the rare opportunities that I would be firing a gunshot. Make sure our scope's not yeah good. I know we got a bear right over there. Let's give our rifle a quick clean as well. This is my beauty. Beautiful Springfield. Hmm. Gorgeous piece of craftsmanship. I like to take it back to my uh, my friend in Valentine. is a gunsmith there, and he um, very very good at what he does. Got me some nice leather wraps for it too. You know what, Mercy? You stay right here. So I'm pretty sure I heard a grizzly. Where are you, big bummer? I wonder if I have any of those scent markers that Harriet gave me. Uh, I don't believe I remember how to get to them. Break right trigger. Fair enough. Grizzly lives for another day. Kate's coming over tomorrow. You're quite excited. Good news, good news. Always good to hear. One loves a visit. I think this might be the old outpost up here. Sometimes we get, uh, we do get some hunters just hanging out here and, uh, staying. It's a bit of a halfway house. I don't even know if the original owner exists anymore. 
But occasionally you find some people. Some friendlier than others, but uh, sometimes there's no one here. It's always worth going in to check out just to see if there's uh, anything delightful that anyone's left behind. <laughs> Hashtag save the bears. Wingers, you probably saved that bear's life. Gonna do some photo editing. Or letting her to do it anyway. Nice, nice. You stay here, Messi. You're a good person, that's why. I'm sure that's what it is. They seem to be moving pretty quick. Oh. Looks like they might be doing a little bit of work for Maggie. Or someone else. Mm, the hunters have definitely been here recently with the fires going, but they might have left for the day. We'll leave their food and stuff here. I'm not going to clean them out, I don't really need it. That's not what we're out here for. But I will have a little bit of a look around in case there's anything uh, particularly special. Especially if it's something that I can take to Madame Nazar. Knock knock! Ooh, my spider sense is tingling. Grits, a Bible, the usual. Hmm. Could have sworn that I. Oh, there we go. Hmm. Page of Wands. Have you? Do I only play in first person? Uh, when I'm doing these sorts of things, because this is part of a set that I have yet to come up with a better name for, but it's currently called Moseying with My Eyes. And they're usually uh, shorter episodes um, where I just kind of wander around and explore the world and we go shopping and it's, very, it's usually pretty peaceful stuff. It's to. It's to sort of uh, be kind of like my version of um, <laughs> the lo-fi beats to, to study to, I guess. But no, I do play third person. I do play third person when I'm doing missions and that sort of thing, usually. Yeah, there's nothing under the sink, nothing worth it, no alcohol. It's usually a good place to stash it. I don't think the hunters live here. I'm pretty sure they're just passing through. But it does look like the owner's been here. Ooh, I'll have that candy. It's gonna go bad if I don't take it. You prefer the peaceful side of things? You try not to engage with others unless they shoot first? Yeah, yeah, I, I usually, that's that's usually the case with me as well. I, um, I like to keep things pretty chill. But it's the same whether I'm doing this or whether I, uh, I'm going on an adventure with, uh, Ms. Ravencroft's descendant in a few hundred years. Uh, driving cars around and heisting from casinos. Usually, if I'm uh, if I'm playing these kinds of games, 
dealing with other people. It just costs you. Uh, it costs you currencies. And I'd prefer to make it than uh, spend it on frivolous fighting and bickering. Hey, dog. How you doing? You remind me of my dog. Hello. You friendly? You seem friendly. Oh, there's two of you. Hello. Can you smell my dog on me, can you? How you doing, buddy? Oh, you're a good-looking fella, aren't ya? You want Pats too, huh? Don't worry, guys. I won't stay around for too long. Hey, buddy. Yeah? Really? Much easier to be kind than be a dick. Unless your name's Richard, yes. I agree. Sometimes certain people make it difficult to be kind. Knock knock. Oh, it's locked. I wonder if we can get in through the front. Hello? Ah, it's all locked up. Ooh. Hello, Banjo. I don't want to play you anyway. Alright, come on, Mercy. We should keep moving. Yeah, I know. I should have roped you over there. With, with You could have made new friends. But we d it didn't happen. I'm sorry. Remind me next time. I'll tell you what, I'll give you I'll give you a special trait. I'll give you I'll give you some some meal, yeah? You want some? Good boy. Yeah, just sit back and relax, wingers. Just chill. That's what today's all about. And if you ever need just some, uh, some peace with varying levels of, uh, RP, depending on how I'm feeling on the day, I think this is the fifth or sixth episode. You can find all the other ones, all the history. Over on the, the tubes in a special playlist. Hello. They should another update where animals mate in the wild. Ah. Uh, I don't know if I'd go that far. Maybe in the next one. They already spent all the manpower on making horse testicles shrink and grow, uh, depending on how cold it is. Hmm. Uh, let's have a quick look at our map. So this is the outpost. Let's head south for a little bit. Cause that's our that's our moonshine shack over there. That's Maggie. Keeping the business going. She's a trooper. One good eye, but... I wouldn't want to fight her. Because the one eye that she's got that's good is her good eye, and she's a damn good shot. Although I could beat her in a foot race, but don't tell her that. Damn, Marcel makes some good moonshine, though. You shall be lurking, Sarvane. Too easy, my friend. Appreciate you hanging out. Appreciate you, uh... 
Coming along for the mosey. Ooh. Something that makes things a little bit more interesting too. I have all the names and markers turned off. So as you'll see, there's there's barely any HUD. All the HUD that we have is dynamic. Turns on and off as we uh, as we go, as is needed. I'll have that sage though. Um, but also, there's no there's no names overhead of uh, my horse. There's no names over the head of any players either. So we don't know if somebody is an NPC or a player. You gotta go to Bunnings and buy some stuff for work. And then probably mow the grass. Ah, oh, what a way to spend a relaxing Sunday doing shit. Have some chicken. Yeah, get yourself, get while you're out, get yourself like... Either, either buy yourself some lunch. Something really nice. Oh, he's a three star. Shit. He's a big boy. You may just have some chicken. Hey, if that's what today calls for. You know, you gotta take your wins where they where they count. Oh, it's starting to rain. That's good for us. What is that? We're not the only thing out here hunting today. If we don't kill him here... We're not going to be able to catch him. Fuck. No. Not going to happen. They come here, little fuck. Yeah, that's what I was really hunting. Just wanted to lull that, uh... That elk into a false sense of security. He's long gone. I only hit him with one arrow, but he's going to survive that easy. Let's eat. Are you friendly? Hello, stranger. Yeah. Might bleed out. Or was the hit marker not red? Nah, it wasn't red. No, I think you'll survive. It is a nice bow. It is a very nice bow. I don't have a wrap or anything for it, but... It is a very nice bow. No, I, uh... I think I might have clipped one of his antlers or something. Gotta get the headshots? Yeah, I thought I did. I thought I did, but I, uh... I 
I must have missed him. Then again, I wasn't exactly using the best arrows. Is that wolves? Oh no, that's a whole crew of deer. Look at them go. They're on the run from something. Elk too. Maybe we don't want to go down that way. Maybe we don't want to. Sarvain! Thank you, thank you very much, sir. You and Wingers, both today, going above and beyond. With the gift subs to Snorf and to DJ. Very, very kind of you. Thank you, thank you, my friend. I hope you enjoy your day. I hope, uh... I hope the working side of things goes quickly and uh, easily. And you can just get something to eat and enjoy your afternoon at least anyway. But thank you. Very kind. You getting your nose pierced on Monday? And you're excited? You wanted to do it for ages? Yeah? I think there's a few different... There's a few different ways to have your nose pierced and... Uh, Some of them are really good, really interesting, some of them not so much. We might head up into the scrub, we'll head up this way. Hopefully not run into any, uh, any bears while we're out here. You want Korean fried chicken, but you don't think there are any places? It's unfortunate. I suppose it's pretty late, huh? If it was the middle of the day, would there be somewhere? What is on that roof? Is that a fox on the roof? What are you doing up there, buddy? Hello. What are you up there for? How did you even get up there? What on earth? Just wait here. Wait here, Mercy. Oh, he had a bad day. That's that's a lot of arrows. That's that's someone That's someone leaving a message, making a point. That's more than just, uh, killing someone. But I can hear a twinkle. I can most definitely hear a twinkle. Hmm. Oh, he didn't have a real good time either. A bird's nest? Maybe. Where is it this? No, this is just ginseng. Just ginseng. My check just eats. Welcome back, Snorf. Welcome back. Wisteria? I'll add that to my collection. To my flower press book. Gearing it up to sell to Madame Nazar. She's not normally interested in flowers too much, but uh, I'll win her over. I don't think there's much else here. Place is kind of in ruins. Or well, not kind of, it is it is in ruins.
Might be some in town, but they're not open. Fair enough. Might just have to deal with a cheese sandwich instead. No, don't be sorry for that, Snorf. Not at all. Not at all. I don't mind, really. I really don't. I mean, you're more than welcome. I'm, I'm always open to that kind of thing. There are too many people in this world that try and close that sort of thing off and just ignore it or shut it down or, you know. The people out there that give you that, uh, that feeling of guilt that made you apologize for what that happened in the first place. So, no, I'm not, I'm not like that. Fox is not coming down off there, is he? Alright. I'll leave you to your house then, bud. Best of luck. Do I have my... No, I don't. Oh, yes, I do. Yeah. Good. Ooh, what is going on? That was weird. You don't know how to feel or what to do, really? It might just take a few days, a few weeks even, just to process everything. And by the sounds of things, it ended on pretty good terms, so... You know, you couldn't have asked for much better, really. Under the circumstances. Light over there. Might go check that out. I think I can hear a waterfall too. What is that noise? Is that an elk? I hope that's an elk. Grab that sage for me. Good boy. Was that blackberry? Yeah, it is. Give me that blackberry. like someone on the way past in quite a hurry. Wonder what they're up to. Beautiful bit of countryside. You can see those storm clouds are still rolling through. Probably got a few days of rain. Let's make our way over here. Might head towards that light. See what's over there. Still want to find a good fishing spot too. Is that something that we can grab on the way through? No. No, just, uh, just weeds. You're vaping pink lemonade at the moment. It's very nice. Oh, wow. Is that what I think it is? It is. Woo! It's not really a, a happy way around it.
that its head or its butt? Not even sure which way the wind's blowing. Can't really tell. Gonna find out though. I think we're looking at the back end. Come on, buddy. Just need one good shot. That didn't kill us. Go back up down the hall. Long Hello, Lewis. Welcome, welcome. How are you today? The river. The bear is probably still going to be up there, though. It'll be alright. We'll get him. So. Gotta get back to Mercy. Oh, mint. Hey, Dad. I gotta make food. Mm, grab all this. How much is there? Sorry you haven't been in here in a while. How's everyone? Don't apologize. It's all good. You're okay. You can thank Snow for the voice too. But it's only for a couple more minutes and then Cuttlefish can go away. Yeah. <coughs> if it doesn't die first. Just for them. I don't know where it is. Hmm. 
Nom. 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 Cuttlefish isn't a good hunter when the jack is. Yeah. Cuttlefish just wants to love. But that is your five minutes. I hope you got your points worth. But how are you, Lewis? I hope you've been doing okay, my friend. They're not wolves. Coyotes generally keep you alone. I'll leave you alone. You're doing good? That's good to hear. That's good to hear. Today's a little bit less action-packed. It's um, just a moseying stream today. We're doing a little bit of hunting. Well, less hunting and more just uh, exploring, I guess. What is this? Is this a raccoon? Get out of here, raccoon. We're out here, harvesting. Bigger flowers. I can hear gunshots way off in the distance. I kind of want to stay out of uh, the way of whatever's causing it. Is this blackberries? Yeah, it is. Give me that. Uh, that much. I can't read it because even though the overlay is way smaller now, it's literally taped over it. Well, not literally taped, but it is it is directly over where the, the dollar sign is. More time. I'll take that. Bit of creeping time. <laughs> no, no, I just don't have a ton of stuff to spend it on anymore. Far from rich. I usually wait until uh, a nice pamphlet's on sale or something. Pretty sure that that bear, yeah, he was just here because that's my hat, I think. Well, I think it is. Yeah, there we go. Good to have that back on my head. But I don't know where he went. That does scare me a little bit. But he didn't go after Mercy, so that's good. What do I mean is over it? Uh, the, the overlay. So when you stream direct from console, you get like a... Like a... a a marker thing that's like your microphone's working you don't have a camera plugged in you're currently live like just little symbols and um it's in the top right corner of my screen so it's just it's over where where the money and, and gold is I can see I've got 75 uh level up token things and then I've got one gold bar and then some other yellow numbers after that and then money so I actually don't have any idea how much money I have right now but I know I made a, a sale last time I played, so it can't be too bad. That's why Crips is whinging. Yeah, yeah, bud. Stopping by. Fuck, I feel like it's been night time for days. Oh, mercy. You stay here. I'm going to have a quick chat with Gus. Nice kill. Feel free to peruse the wares. Nice kill. What? The the skunk that I shot at because I missed the elk. Yeah, sure. All right, let's have a look. See. You can have him if you want. Dollar fifty. Sure, why not? 
and you want to buy you want to buy the, the skunk sacks sure I guess You just joined the Discord and it says channel verification is too high. Um, as long as you've clicked on the thing on the rules channel or whatever, basically it just makes sure that you've been a member. I think you've got to be a member for 10 minutes before it'll let you post anywhere. Because it stops any like bots or swarms or anything from coming in and just tanking it without at least a little bit of a buffer. But it should it should let you in, Lewis. Let me know if there's anything else you it's need. just, uh, I think it's a 10 minute cooldown. Once you join. Now oh, I can buy that as a coat. But let me know if you do have other issues. Um, I know people have before. They've had problems getting into it, but it's... I'm pretty sure that once you join, as long as you're verified and stuff, it should just be a, a 10 minute thing. The haunting round here. I can't believe I never made it out this way in my younger days. I'd have left a river of blood through these forests. I'm sure you would have, Gus. I'm sure you would have. I don't know if I want any, uh... Random skunk hats or anything. Be a bit, um. A bit shitty looking, to be honest. It'd kind of be maybe Good cute as a plushie, but. Another rare animal's been spotted. A majestic specimen, if the rumors are to be believed. I imagine it will attract other hunters, so move fast. I only use the best, I only sell the best. And it is. Hmm. Whoa, that's a very fluffy coat. A perfect bear coat. And I can, uh... I pride myself on the quality get myself product. a bear jacket. Man, if I'd, uh... If I'd landed that shot... Oh well. Hmm. Definitely a warm weather jacket, isn't it? Yeah, very warm. Too warm for hot weather. Yeah. Simple little jacket. Years, I know my stuff. Poncho that looks kind of kind of dumb. It's kind of a shitty looking poncho. That's the sort of thing that you'd wear if uh, you know you're a Viking, I guess. Let's say. Hey. Interesting. You looking for something in particular? Gloves. Perfect goat hide. Oh, I've got to go and upset someone's farm for that. I think. They're quite fancy gloves, though. Long cliff pants for a perfect buck pelt. Nah, most of these things they look a bit shit. Sorry, Gus. You you enjoy your hunting, but you you're not a. Uh, you're not a not a, a fashionista. Okay, do you think we can hurry this along a bit? No, I'm sorry. You can wait. Permanently slow degradation of weapons. Higher chance of receiving better quality pelts and skins from animals in perfect condition. Hmm. Interesting. Force bonding rate increased. Creeping time, oregano and wild mint. I only use Yield the two best. Time. I only sell the best. Except for those those jackets. Well, the jackets are nice actually, the, but the, the, everything else is garbage. I pride myself on a quality product. Yeah, no, I understand that, but it doesn't mean that it necessarily has to be tasteful. It could be high quality, but if it looks like shit, I'm not going to buy it. Decrease the speed that horse health and stamina cause drain. That's not bad either. That's not bad either. Of 
equipment variants for the bow. Interesting. Interesting. Made to order saddlebags. Perfect beaver pelt. There you go. Whatever you do out there, avoid that lunatic Davenport at all costs. She's nothing but a neurotic rich girl with too much time on her hand. Look, better Harry... than anything you'll find in the store. Well, I, I don't think I'll find her in the store, but Harriet has on multiple occasions drugged me and dumped me in the wilderness. So I I do have to say that it it's a love hate relationship between us. All so we'll get some arrows. Uh, I don't need I don't need bullets though. Cheers for that, Gus. I'm sure I we'll run into each other again, bud. To please, but I shoot to kill. Sure you do, buddy. Sure you do. We'll head north. Should be a good fishing spot up here somewhere. We have to find our way back to the road, though. That's down to our left. Nice and sunny today. I thought those storms would be still here, but uh, they've all cleared out by the looks of it. Slow down, slow down. You're all right. Okay. You want a brush? Chill out. Have a bit of a brush, yeah. Good boy, don't walk into trees. I'm just brushing now. Beautiful little creek. Beautiful little creek. I love it. I have 131, 139. Oh, what do you mean? Oh. Okay. Hey, uh. Hey, yeah, I'm not gonna shoot you, bud. You're all good. Keep going. Oh. My, uh. My collectible sense is tingling there. Oh, dollars if my golden money was converted to current inflation rates. There you go. It's not a... Uh, not too small a bit of money. Nothing to sneeze at. I wonder if we've got... Nah, we'll probably just go all the way up. We'll probably go all the way upstream. We'll go all the way upstream and then we'll, um... Ooh, burdock root. Pretty sure that's toxic. Pretty sure burdock root's toxic. One ounce is $18.94. And a gold bar on average is 400 ounces. 18.94 American dollars? Hmm. Well, there you go. I did not know that. Little part of me has always thought it would be cool to own a gold bar of like just to get bullion. Not because it's not not for any particular reason, like a lot of people go, Oh, you know, gold is the way to go, it's good to invest in gold because it's, you know, it's static. It doesn't fluctuate as wildly as a lot of other things and you know, it's a safety net or whatever. You know, people go, Oh yeah, it's good to have it because you know, all these sorts of reasons. I just want it because I think it would be cool. I'm a bit childish like that. 
But it doesn't make it any less cool. Roughly 7,200... Careful, squirrels. Roughly 7,200... I'm going to put my small game arrows. Yeah. Gotcha, bitch. Um... I don't remember what I was saying. I got distracted by a squirrel, and now all it is is like, mm, ooh, ah, squirrel. Come here, squirrel. You're a perfect one. Oh, you're coming with me, buddy. Might head to sleep. Got a busy day today. Two easy wingers. Crash out. Rest easy, bud. Good night, gorgeous. Oh, look. You sweet talker, you. I'll help you get to sleep anytime. But, that said, I hope you enjoy the visit. I hope you enjoy the, uh, the, f the, the photo editing with, uh, with Kate, was it? It was Kate, isn't it? Yeah. And, uh, I hope you have a good day, and we do need to, to play a bit of Red Dead soon. For sure. I'm always down for a bit of Red Dead, man. I don't play it enough. Hello. I don't play it enough, and I love this world. Like, I... As you can see, it's one of the few games that I can just walk around and live in, because it's just... It's just... It's just gorgeous. Going to sleep to my voice. You would be not the first. And a lot of people would find it uh, as a negative thing, but I find it a compliment. Because that's kind of the point. Oh, look at that. Oh, boy. We are going fishing today. Yeah, buddy. Time for a lurk. Too easy. Thanks for dropping by. And thanks again for gifting this up to Snorf. Very kind. Oh, bull rushes. You like bull rushes? What is that? Is there seriously a bear here? No. There's a bear here. I'm not going to let this one uh, continue to be here. It's so welcome to fuck off. What's that over there? Just here somewhere, I think. It's not marked on the map. I might go check that out too. Got it wrong. My gold's worth 106,000. In 1899, when Red Dead was set, and it's now worth 7.08 million today, plus the $23,872 is what your money would be in current time. So roughly 7.1 million is how much your gold and cash would be in American dollars. That's that's a lot higher than uh, that's a lot higher than 113,000 or whatever it was. I'll take that for sure. For sure. That's set for life kind of money. That's set for life kind of money, for sure. Eighteen ninety nine, one ounce of gold was almost nineteen dollars. And now it's twelve hundred and fifty. What is that noise? It's a camp, is it? Hmm. Someone's camp. Might give that a bit of a wide berth. We'll just head over here and do a bit of fishing. You think? Yep. 
Don't know what you're referring to, but if I said it, I probably think it. Unless I don't. Then I probably don't. But only mostly. <sighs> what a spot. I haven't been in a, I haven't been for a swim, like a proper swim, whether it be in a pool or at the beach or whatever for ooh, going on a couple of years now. <gasps> bunny, shoot bunny, a oh, bunny gone. Shoot, hmm, bunny. Ah, he's only a two star. What are you, bird? enough money to settle down for life. Oh yeah, no, I, I, yeah. Yeah, I believe that. Especially American dollars. I mean, that much in Australian dollars is enough to settle down a few times over. Easy. Easy. You'd love seven million? I'd love one. Hell, I'd love seven thousand right now. Any, any, any free money is, um... You know, you go and win the lottery or whatever. It's always, uh, always an exciting time. Also, I've heard I don't buy lottery tickets myself. Mercy, we might tie you up just over here, if you don't mind. You'd take anything, exactly, exactly. You know, you're not gonna, you're not gonna get a gift of. You know, 20 bucks. Someone's not going to give you 20 bucks for nothing. Is that gunshots over there? Nah. It's a bird or creaking trees or some shit. But yeah, you're not going to get somebody that's going to give you 20 bucks and be like, Oh, I'd really wish that this was a million instead. You're going to go, sick. Why did that sound like a gator? Knock. Let's close this behind us, I think. Ooh, free cigarettes. Eh, I don't want them. I don't smoke. If you had 7 million, you would have a decent house and about 40 cars. 40 cars? And I'm guessing you'd be hiring somebody to take care of them. Because if that otherwise that'd be a full-time job. Open Kentucky bourbon. That's eh, kind of a bit gross. I'll take that coffee though. Do love a bit of coffee in the morning. Hmm. That telescope. Nice uh, makeshift tanning rack they've got as well. Hmm. Not, a, not, not the worst little shack I've seen, but is a bit rough around the edges. We got a nice little lookout spot here over the lake. Oh, hey, big fella. Three star as well. Stay right there, buddy. I'm gonna stay away from that smoke. Frog. No, 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 I don't care about the moonshiners operation. I don't give a shit. Here for my help. G'day, Saints. Welcome, welcome. How are you today, my friend? We're having a, uh. Well, what up until probably 10 seconds ago was a, a pretty peaceful day. We're just walking around and seeing the world. Um, going for a bit of a mosey. 
So nothing, nothing particularly action packed today. We're about to go fishing, except I get a little bit too close to those moonshiners, and uh, that shit's getting a bit excited. But I hope you're having a good one. Hello, fish. I'm going to catch some of you. Considering it's 2:30 a.m., you're doing better than you should. Yeah, sounds like it's uh, sounds like it's bedtime. You'd have so many cars, like most people have one dream car and you have 13. That's a lot of dream cars. Alright, what sort of location are we at? Where are we? You gonna, uh... You gonna tell me what kind of location we're at? you like me to stand on more stable land? Or is it because you want me to destroy the moonshiners? Because I'm not doing that. I'm going to guess it's just a lake, not a... Uh, not a swamp. Attracts all medium and large size lake fish. Increases your chance of catching all medium and large size lake fish. Sure. Why not? Dream cars? The Peel P50. Yeah, I don't know cars. I don't know cars. You guys are on your own. I The only cars that I know are usually from video games. I remember the first car that I drove in a video game that I wanted was a Lamborghini Diablo. And that's as far as my mind has really gone since. So I'm not 100% sure what a Peel P50 is. Here, fish, 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 fish. This is some intense music for fucking fish hunting. Fish hunting? That's what it is, isn't it? Technically. Come here, you. Gotcha, bitch. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on. Give her some slack, then reel her in. How big are you, buddy? What do you got? 1.84 kilos. Not huge. Not huge, but it's alright. the world's smallest car and it has four four horsepower. Sounds hilarious. First car you ever wanted was the M3 GTR from Need for Speed Most Wanted. Mine was the Lamborghini Diablo, funnily enough, from Need for Speed. Like, not Need for Speed, Hop Shoot, or anything like that. Need for Speed. I think I was, I want to say, seven or eight. think. Maybe nine. Got a push. Come on, fish. Come on, fish. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. You got this. We work together. You can go in my saddlebags. You got a friend in there. Uh... Again, not real big, but I'll keep it. The wide body kit gives me feelings a car shouldn't give. It's like, uh... Oh, look at that. Look at the sun shining in. Gorgeous. Uh, I think we're going to have to go for a little bit of a ride so that this music can fuck off. I don't want to... She's tied up. Mercy, get out of here. Go for a walk. The 
sun shining through these trees is just too pretty. Yeah, it reminds me of the Dukes of Hazard line. Where he's like... I want to fuck this car. He's like, you mean you want to fuck in this car? He's like, no, I want to have sex with it. Funny movie. Doesn't really have much parallel to the actual original series. Your posse abandoned the job. Hell yeah, dude. I was interested. You tried to make me do it. I didn't want to do it. Take that bull rush though. It's like most of the other plants, you have the opportunity to eat. Even the ones that make you sick. It's like, do you wish to eat this bull rush? <laughs> like, yes, delicious. Um, and it's just. Bleh. Why does it keep sounding. Why do they sound like alligators? They're not alligators. This all this is all bulrushes, yeah? It's like shitloads of bulrushes all along the river. Or all along the lake. First car you wanted was a Lamborghini Aventador SVJ. Yeah, not bad. Not a, not a terrible choice. We'll probably do a GTA stream pretty soon, and we'll do some car customizations and stuff. Quite expensive in the States, but not as much as an R34. It's funny, there's a lot of cars, just normal run-of-the-mill cars, that it's cheaper in Australia to import a Mustang and get it all, get all the papers all sorted out so that it's street legal in Australia. Um, it's cheaper to get, yeah, cheaper to get a Mustang and get it street legal in Australia than it is to get like a brand new. Oh, fish fucked off. We'll try another cast. What do they all fuck off? I think they all fucked off. Is that one jumping out of the water over there? Hmm, we'll try here. Dream cars are Mazda RX-7. You've always been into more regular cars. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with regular cars. You can do a lot to them, just because you see a lot of regular cars out on the streets. Doing, uh, normal everyday stuff. Ooh, fish! Come. Come, fish! Ooh, boy. Come on. Come this way, buddy. In here. Come on, 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 come on. Come here. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. No, no, come on. Don't you fucking pull me off this fucking pier. Come here. Come on, little fella. Let's work together and we can make you dinner. Sorry, make you into dinner, not make you dinner. That was, that was a bad choice of words. Ooh. Use a big one. Okay. Yeah, I'll keep you. Oh, show. An R34 in America is illegal without a permit, which only allows you to drive it a thousand miles a year. The last one sold at auction was over 300,000 or something like that. There's nothing special about it, you just want to give, an auto give it an autopsy and slap a whole rocket bunny kit on it. Mm, you guys are saying things that sound exciting. Ooh, another storm. It's been raining a lot this week. Do I not have bait on it? I should do. Cheese and stuff too. Corn bait, cheese bait. 
Riverfish. Oh, wham. Wait a second. What does it say? No, no, don't put it all... Whatever. This way? Yes, this way. Favourite amount of anglers, they make up in fight for what they lack in taste. The flaky fish meat can be eaten. They like crayfish bait. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Move over here and do a little bit of... A little bit of fishing over this way, I think. Crayfish bait? But that means we're in a swamp, doesn't it? I wouldn't consider this a swamp. I mean, I'll give them it. They can have it. But... I wouldn't consider this a swamp. Bling. Come on, you. Oh, 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 oh. Go, 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 go. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, no. Come on, this way. It's like fighting Bowser in Mario 64. It took the bait. Happily took the bait. But it's the wrong fish. The brim. Cheese is a good bait. But I use crayfish. Because the other fish that like crayfish. I'm so confused. I'll use, I'll use cheese then, I guess. Bling. That was weird. Holy shit. Instantly. Lures are great, but baits just godly. So we're gonna get another brim? Come on. No, no, no. No, what are you? They flavor cornmeal bait. I don't understand. I don't understand how fish work. I'm not. I, I'm not smarter than a fish. The fish are outsmarting me easily. Easily. <sighs> okay. Um. All right then. He's only little. Interesting. Interesting. America seems like the worst place to own JDM cars. Wouldn't the laws be different state to state as well? coming in. Do a, a little bit more fishing. Depending on uh,
There we go. See, now they're not interested. They're like, oh, old Barry, he got cheese. He got cheese, and all we fucking got is some bit of plastic. Fun fact fish have almost. Fish have a longer attention span than the average human by almost two seconds. I wouldn't be surprised, to be honest. Come on, fish. Well, something weird's going on with the, uh, the light over on the beach there. Nah, they're not interested. They're not interested. I think we're done for the evening. Um... Let us set up. We'll set up a, a little fire. See if we can keep it going in the rain. We got a bunch of fish. A couple of split bullets that we used. America has a 25 year import ban on vehicles from the year below 2000. That's odd. I guess it's, I guess America makes a lot of vehicles so importing is bad for the economy or whatever. America's weird, you can drive a bathtub as long as it's got brakes and lights, but Japanese cars are the devil as long as it's an American made bathtub. You're so happy you don't live in America, so your dream cars aren't illegal. That's one way to look at it, yeah. Hmm. I might tear down the camp. With that rain, I can feel how cold it is. Like, I'm cold here today. And it's just adding to it. Hey, frog. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, frog. Hey, listen, frog. Wait, where'd you go? Frog. Frog? Wait. That's my footprint. Where's frog? Frog? Frog. Eh. Come here. Get in my pocket. I live in Hungary, so everything I would do with cars is illegal. You can't even swap engines unless it's the same engine type, which makes it utterly pointless. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna swap out this engine for an exact duplicate. Oh yeah, now I'm ready for the racetrack. Huh. Who the fuck lit these candles? Demons? Yeah, you're gonna pull out... And and is too, but and but in and is. Uh, quickest way to give somebody an aneurysm. Make him read that sentence. There's nothing sexy in here. I'm still pissing down rain. Should probably try and find out where Mercy is. Mercy. Oh, Mercy, where are you? That fucking horse. Wait. Oh, you're over here. Hello. Where have you been? 
Looks like the rain stopped. What is this? Is this anything? I feel like it is. Let's go and have a look at that. Let's go see what's over there. If there is anything, great. If there isn't, eh, we had a look. On oh, LS, okay. <laughs> that just I read the sentence of I'm gonna pull out an is to but in an is. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna pull out an LS too, but in an LS. Still doesn't make a hundred percent sense to me, but I get ya. Not an is, yes. You still can't type in Discord. Do you have a email account attached to your Discord account that is verified? just to the right here. Three little dots. How do I check? Uh, it should be in your account settings or something. Um, or it might give you an option on the Discord and say that the where it's got like the verification levels too high or whatever it said. Um, it might give you an option there to like click something and say yes I would like to do a thing. Ooh a pear? A corn? Got a feeling that these guys won't be needing it anymore. Beautiful spot. Right on the edge of the lake. They're tucked away here. See, this would be not too bad a spot if this was, uh... Ark Survival Evolved. We were hiding. Crackers. I love crackers. Give me some crackers. Um, yeah, it should be it should be somewhere in your account settings, Lewis. You should be able to find, um, whether you've got an email attached or not, that's verified. What is that? Are you another bear? Oh, mate. Stop it. Ah, uh, it's a bull elk. I'm not fucking around with a bull elk. What's that? It's a rock. Mmm, dangerous rock. Alright, Mercy, let's get out of here. I tried so hard to love this game, but it made me want to claw my eyes out. Um, because it's just too beautiful? What do you mean? It's working now? Nice. Is that a snake? Yeah, yeah, I know, Mercy. Just chill. Oh, shit! It's right underneath me. I think. You've never played? It looks pretty. It's, it's pretty good. It's a pretty good game. Diamondback. Hey, Mr. Snake. Fuck, he's moving. Nearly got him. Gotcha, bitch. Got you too, frog. You will both be mine. I'll have those arrows back too, thank you. It's so slow and sluggish, just going from place to place annoys you. Yeah, I mean... I get that. I understand. Um, but to me, like... It's, it, like, I don't... It, 
it's easy to see that it's like it's easy to compare it to something like GTA for obvious reasons, or it's easy to to look at it as like oh it's going to be an action-packed game. I think that riding from one side of the map to the other for a mission is yes boring. I don't. I, like, I still haven't gotten past, like, Chapter 3 in the single player. I play online. Like, I'm currently playing online. And I'm making my own adventures. I'm just basically living in the world. I do missions when I want to do missions. The missions in online are pretty good because they're pretty quick. Like, they don't make you ride across the map for no reason. You're just there. Ooh. Sorry, horse. I nearly got you there. Um... And I just do what I want to do. But then again, I also enjoy just sort of living in worlds and chilling out and for the same reason that I could lose myself walking around, you know, Athens in uh, Assassin's Creed without actually doing a mission or killing anything, just walking around looking at stuff. Part of what I like about this, you can just chill. You want to go into town and go all guns blazing? Go for it. But, uh... You can fast travel easy enough. So you can get to wherever you need to be. You play Fallout 4 Survival. You don't get that bored of walking place to place. Is it on Game Pass? This, I don't believe so, no. I don't believe it's on Game Pass. You can have a look. But I, I don't think it is, no. It's Rockstar, so I um I would be surprised if it was. But I know they've split it off, so there's like they've got the online component separate to story mode now, so you can get them individually. You bought it for the story because you watch playthroughs and it's awesome, but everything in between you just can't. Yeah, I, I get that as well. Like again, riding from place to place is sort of ugh, but um. I think I think that's that's part like there were definitely there's definitely I've seen some people play the storyline and I, I've noticed one of the problems that comes up which weird it's weird but if you like something that's pretty common if you go and try and just mainline the story and just try and sort of power through it um, it does make you sort of go oh you finished here go right over there for ages and do a thing and that gets old pretty quick. Whereas if you're just sort of like bopping around the place and then making your way to the missions, then it's like, okay. Not that I'm trying to sell it to you or anything, but... Um, it's, definitely, it's definitely not as broad a... Uh, 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 it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't appeal to uh, everybody that thinks it does. That's not a sentence. That's not a sentence. We'll try that again. As a game, Red Dead looks like it would be a really cool cowboy adventure for so many people. You know, something, something exciting, something in the world. It looks good. It sounds good. It feels pretty good. You know, moment to moment. But, uh... You have a fine morning, ma'am. You too, buddy. I'm just fine without your company, and that don't need to change. Mate, What's the you, issue? you wanna fucking start shit? Guess you forgot you was yelling. For me, yellow. But yeah, it's a it's the type of game that I play for moments that you just sort of can appreciate the art and the the, the amount of work that went into the world, I guess. But there's a reason that I play online instead of story mode. Well, that falls an all-time favorite. You played it where you were literally poisoned. You were poisoned? 
you literally just downloaded a bunch of mods on Fallout to make it realistic, and you like hunting and camping in Fallout, but you find it fun. Yeah. Yeah, I like that sort of thing. I kill a lot of time just fucking around. Feel the opposite. You just throw on some Halo armor and weapons mods, some colorful lights, faction wars, and put it to the test. Also fun. Also fun. Um. When I when I did, I wouldn't really call it a playthrough, but when I played Skyrim on stream, which was the game that I started with, um, I modded the hell out of it. And, uh, I went sort of for a balance between, like, your survival elements of, you know, you need to do all these sorts of things and combat was a lot harder and all this sort of stuff. But then also just, like, I love a good variety of things. Like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a sucker for, like, ooh, this is a weapon that I'll never use, but it's different. You know? Fair enough. For a slower story experience, you highly recommend Age of Airships 2 for Fallout 4? Or Office Drama Simulator? Been playing Hitman recently, I've never played a game so much. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm keen to get... What is that? Oh my god. I want that. He needs to come with me now. Shibi! Oh, Shibi! What are you? No. Is that it there? Is that it there? Are you it? You're it. Don't you fucking run. He's hurt. He's gonna bleed out. Where are you, buddy? I can hear you. Hey, hey, hey. It's alright. Come on. It's okay. It'll be quick. Okay. Played it before. And then it got added to VR now. PewDiePie's making videos of it, so that's cool. Yeah, I've I haven't seen any of his. I've seen um I've seen some of the Call Me Kevin ones. Call Me Kevin's pretty funny too. Um I've heard that it's pretty buggy though. Right now you're two hundred and seventy hours in Elden Ring working on the last achievement and you want nothing but more Elden Ring. Yep. I've heard that a lot about that. Apparently that's um some are, some are using the phrase masterpiece. Oh wait, no, hold on. I don't want to start a moonshine thing. Oh, that's that way. No. Hey, bunny. Before I get lost in the wilderness and attacked by bears. Yeah, okay. Good. Crips is over this way. I haven't played the VR version, but there's no problems for you. Yeah, no, no, no. The, the normal version is pretty, pretty st solid. It's, it's stable, but the VR version apparently is very, very buggy, but in a funny way. And that's coming from somebody who never cared about playing anything Souls related. Yeah, I mean, it sucked in a lot of people that never played. Yay, yeah, Red Dead. Oh, nope, it's an ad. Okay. Well, when you're done with your ad, Leana. I have no beef Looks with you, like buddy. You're just how to hunt with those kills. Excuse me. Just because it's a sheep. It's a fucking good sheep. Alright, leave me alone.
Good morning, Liana. I hope you enjoyed your tire ad. I'm up early. I'm up late. I'm up late. Um, from probably 5 o'clock last night, so... Had a late night. Late, 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 late night. But how are you? How have you been? How goes Black Desert? You still playing Black Desert? A chipmunk? Adorable. Ah, uh, old mate's coming down the road behind me. Oh, get off the road, chipmunk. The tire ad was a uh, was representative of the, this game that I found. It was a good incentive for me to try Red Dead. <laughs> Red Dead, best car game. Run, little deer. Fuck, they're going all over the place. Stay out of my way, you lot. Ooh, ooh. Oh, I missed him. Oh, I missed him again. Yeah. Chipmunk. Ah, fuck him. He's free. Be free, little chipmunk. Be free. Can't wait to put some BBS on my IC swapped horse. Oh yeah, but if if you swap out the engine, you got to swap it to an identical one. All the car talk is all Greek to me. Yeah, I don't, uh, I don't get it much either, DD. It's got enough wheels and it goes room. Must be a car. That's about as far as my car knowledge goes. Did he seriously run down to the camp anyway? Oi. If you got a death wish, just tell me, yeah? You didn't have to come down here. But you did anyway. You silly little fucker. Come on, you. Wait, is that my camp? Huh, I thought that those rocks were my tents. I guess he wasn't. Come on, Mercy. I'm going for a walk. Greek Malaka Wanker Good morning. Morning. Who else likes a twin turbo V eight horse with a wide body and, and an exhaust? I don't know about the wide body. You wanna keep something lean. Drop the suspension a little bit. IE just cut it off at its ankles. That image nightmare, here we come. Yep. Come on, horse. You got this, Mercy. I'm gonna give this shit. Stay. Stay. Wait. No, don't give me kisses. Wait. Can I get to this table, please? Where are you going? What are you doing? Do you have brain worms? Are you okay? Come to me. Come on. My horse is kind of slow. Am I treating them right? Lots of food, not weighed down. Hey. At least I don't stack my horse and crash it, Leana. I've seen things. I've seen things you do. If Bugatti makes heated razors, who's to say they won't sell horses soon? Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure they've wanted to sell horses all along. Everyone calls it horsepower, right? Supplies are starting to run low, just so you know. 
okay. We can give him the frogs. Excellent. Thank you. Yep. Because the frogs and shit aren't worth fucking anything, but he this can have them. Quality. Here you go, have a chipmunk. Very nice. And a squirrel. Good stuff. Perfect snake, you can have that too. Beautiful. That's Perfect chip. Notch. And I don't see why not. You may as well have the antlers as well. I know you're a butcher, but you could grind them up into some sort of aphrodisiac powder or something. I don't fucking know. It's your business. It's your business, Crips. Oh, six out of ten small animal carcasses sold to Crips. I see. So what I should really do is go after the rest of those chipmunks. What a beautiful spot for a camp. Come over here first thing in the morning. Pee off the edge of the cliff. Such a pretty game. We gotta go north. I might go this way to the river crossing. Head east first and then go north. So we're gonna be the easiest way to strawberries. You guys seen the Saints Row customization showcase? No? Yeah, that's cool. I haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen it yet. I didn't know that they had a had a thing out. Is it new like trailery sort of dealio or was it a lake? I'm guessing it's going to be out pretty soon, so it's probably real. They're a tractor company, so they're going electric, so they might just go horsepower again. Yeah. Who knows? No, you wouldn't. You wouldn't fall. You'll have. You'll have your coffee and yeah, you know, whatever else you got going on. It'll be fine. Have some stew while I'm here too. Mmm, delicious stew. They showed off a lot. They really went balls to the walls with the options. Good. That's a good thing. I like it. You get character customization in some games, it's really disappointing. Like um like Fallout 76 was pretty uh pretty pus as far as the character customization was concerned. To the point that you run around so much and there's like three and a half hairstyles for the characters. If so, everyone has the same shit. <laughs> and here we have the 2023 all-wheel drive horse. Uh, it's actually AHD, not AWD. It's all hoof drive. Mercy here. Mercy thinks he's a... Uh, he thinks he's an ATV. He's not. He's seen. He's seen. Uh, he's seen magazines of, of Skyrim horses. He's not a Skyrim horse. He wishes he was. He's not. Oh. Ah, calm down. Is that an owl? Is that an owl? Pretty sure I heard an owl. Hoot hoot, motherfucker. Alright, alright, alright. You can set how visible your veins are, change teeth color and glow, adjust both sides of your face separately, complete overhaul, completely overhauled guns, fine tune paint and decals so much. That's kind of cool. Ooh, my spider sense is tingling. over here? Oh, is it this? Is that a chocolate one? Is that a chocolate flower? Yeah, it is. Chocolate daisies. Give me that. One of my favorite games for customizations would have to be, um, uh, oh shit, what's it called? A APB? 
um, all points bulletin, APB. Uh, that was kind of like a, like it wanted to be the next GTA. It wasn't, it failed horribly, but it had some really cool ideas. Had some really cool ideas. Um, it just didn't execute them particularly well. And which is unfortunate because I think it did some things that we'll start seeing in games in the future. We just haven't because the game flopped. If you pay an extra 45,000, you get a built-in carriage. Well, hey. Maybe get rid of the horse altogether. Best horse is no horse, right? That's the fastest kind of horse. When the horse doesn't even have to race. By the way, I think you'd like Alex. has got an amazing world to explore. Just constant wallpaper vibes. Uh, I did want to get Alex. Before it came out. Um... I kept an eye on it for a little while, and then, oh, I thought that was a, I thought that was a, a sheep in need, but it wasn't. Um, and it looks cool. I love the whole three worlds mashed together in a, a pretty plausible way, uh, type of storyline, and you know, like your your fantasy, sci-fi, post-apocalyptic wasteland sort of thing, all all tied together. I think that's really really cool. But, and this is nothing against people that enjoy Piranha Bite stuff. Um, the reason that I'm I'm scared to get it uh, is because I'm I'm um, I'm allergic to jank, too much jank anyway. In certain ways, and the game the game has to outshine the jank. You think Bugatti will make one of the world's best race cars? Maybe. Maybe. One of the world's best race horses. But just more bull rush? No, what's that? What are you? Messi? Chomp. Bird or crude. Okay, chomp gently. That's toxic. Don't eat that. Don't lick your lips. Ooh, big storm coming in. Ah. <sighs> I'm hoping that we get to um, strawberry soonish. Strangers requesting help. Hey, bud. You okay. I'm over here. You can hear me, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm glad someone finally came by. I was riding past these markers there, uh, the graves, and my horse, my horse just collapsed. Foam with the mouth, and then nothing. <sighs> Could you give me a ride to town? Please. Uh, it ain't too far. Yeah, man, sure. You will? Well, I got an even better idea. Uh -uh. None of that shit. Not funny. Not funny. Fuck. Fuck, how many of you are around just to steal one horse? Come on. Okay. You guys want the shotguns out? They're gonna be out. You all done? You're not all done. This is supposed to be a peaceful horse ride. Anybody else want to die today? No? Oh. We have a taker. Hey. Cut it out. Stop. It doesn't need to be this. Alright, you could have all just left after I shot you first, dude. For oh, fuck's sake. Oh. 
Don't worry, bud. There's something special for you. Oh, he dodged it. Oh, hit the tree. Fine. Hey, man. Piece of shit. How many people to rob one horse? Like, come the fuck on. <sighs> LX fits perfectly into Eurojank tag. Which, unless you're used to, is a big red flag. I, I've definitely played him before and enjoyed him before, but... Um, like, I played one of the Gothic games many years ago. It was alright, but... Especially since they have funding from the VW group and partnered with Rimac to make the fastest accelerating top speed super case. Hmm. Fair enough. Thanks for playing RDR2 so I don't have to. Hey, I'm just playing online. I don't I don't play the story. Uh, revolver cartridges. Anything worth grabbing? But it's still RDR2. Well then I'm gonna take your sarcasm and I'm gonna say you're welcome and accept it as just real real true to form sentences. But I mean you did take Fallout 76 for a spin and then stopped. So you never know. You might have some Red Dead in your future. But honestly, I'd probably wait until they sort of until Rockstar comes out and says, Yeah, we're not doing we're not doing anything else. Like if you haven't if you're not keen on Red Dead and you haven't played it yet there's no there's no real rush to do it. Have you heard Ubisoft stock prices tanks? It's so bad they're considering selling the company. What? It's not April Fools, is it? I don't believe it is. You don't have to shoot his head off? Hey, look. They came to me. And he dodged all three axes. Magically. So, I did. How does the gamble thing work? Uh, what gamble thing? As in the bot gamble thing in chat? Or as in gambling in Red Dead? Because there is gambling in Red Dead as well. The bot. Um, exclamation point. Well, do exclamation point points, I think. Oh, hello. Hello. And then you'll see how many points you got. And then you can do exclamation point gamble. And then a number of how many points you want to gamble, basically. You're surprised too, they just recently bragged about how much money Valhalla made. Yeah, and Valhalla's fucking expensive. Like, Valhalla's expensive. That said, I did see that, um, I did see Riders Republic is already, like, half price. Um, you know, uh, Far Cry 6 is on sale at the moment for half price. Like, the Whoopty Edition with all the DLC and everything. There's a few things that are, like, on sale earlier than I would have expected them to be. Mm, nothing of value in here. I don't know what's at that smoke, and I don't really want to find out. Moonshine. But I don't want to do moonshine stuff. Is it, like, on the way to strawberry? Of course it is. Of course it is. Are they going to attack me on site? Probably. Gambling all in, and you won. Nice. Yeah, there is a cooldown. Yeah, there's a cooldown. 
It's so that it just doesn't fill up with gambles. You probably won't. The whole Wild West setting doesn't really appeal to me. That's totally cool, DD. Like, like I said, it's not going to be for everybody. Um, and it's 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 quite slow at times. Um, as much as I enjoy just faffing around and existing in the world. It's uh, definitely not for everybody. Hello, gentlemen. We're just passing through. Bloody tax collectors. No. No, no. I'm not taking out the revenue agents. I'm not, we're not doing moonshine and stuff today. Going up to the hills, or is it this way? It's got to be this way, right? Or am I dumb? Oh, it's up into the hills. It's that way. What is this? Is it a bear? What is coming towards me? A wolf or a bear? Mercy don't like it. Mercy doesn't like what's going on. Hello? Is it a bear? I don't know, maybe it was a snake. Maybe it was a snake. We'll be right. He won twice in a row. Nice. I mean, I doubt Microsoft would buy them, but it would be cool. Um, I'm pretty sure Microsoft has gone into a deal with them anyway to get Ubisoft Plus on Game Pass. If I was reading the signs correctly, that's you like it was going to be part of it, the same way that um, EA Access, or whatever the fuck it's called, is part of Game Pass. It could be a good thing if Microsoft buys them, for example, more Game Pass content, more crossovers, more studios to help out. Yeah. Yeah. They've been pretty much closet dating for like two years now, so if anyone gets Ubisoft, it's going to be Microsoft. Yeah. Possible. You never know. I think... I think Sony's doing a little bit of panic buying. I think Sony would be silly if they bought FromSoft. Um, because as much as, yeah, Elden Ring is a hit and has a lot of people very addicted to it, and the next one could be a Sony exclusive, in theory. It's also very specific. It's like putting all your eggs in one basket. DD lost his one point. Oh no. Bam bam. Rigged, yep. <laughs> Everyone wins but DD. Yeah, I've, I've put you on the list that uh, guarantees losses. Sorry, bud. You're on what we call the Nobo list. Nobo loses all the time, too. I didn't abandon the job. I didn't want the job in the first place. You can't... You can't, like, walk past a cafe that says, now hiring, and then they poke their head out the front after you walk past and go, why did you quit? You're like, what the fuck are you talking about? Ah. <sighs> home sweet home. Hey chickens. Hello chickens. Uh, actually you know what? I do need you for another minute, Mercy. I'm gonna go up over this way. You can hang out here. It's a good spot. A bit of water for you, hey? Yeah. Okay. You know where to find home, alright? Just chill. Oh no. Evening there, Missy. Some lightning the other night spooked a herd of cattle into a stampede. Broke True. the fence. They didn't wane until they was almost clear across the county. I'm not surprised. 
Here to Emerald Ranch. So one time I did the gambling thing, it was ages ago, me and this one guy got so many Good points. Evening, yes. We broke it after like 27.4 quintillion, and it went down to zero. Yeah. Yeah, the double and double and double and double and double. And Leana won as well. Good All the points. Well, I've seen you since you handled that last bit of business. Don't think I have. No, no, I left after that. But, uh, probably pick up some work from you in the near future. But in the meantime, I have some post. Uh, I've got to send off some cards. Yeah, no, that's alright, Hector. I don't, uh, don't need anything at the moment. Um, yeah, I need to send off, uh, these three tarot cards off to, uh, to Madame Nazar. No fixed address, but she'll be able to pick it up. Probably from Saint Denis. Do you have anything under my name while I'm here? I'm a Hawks. All right. Yeah. Cool. I'll take them. Looking for some gainful employment by any chance? No, Hector. Don't need gainful employment. Take those slugs as well. Lovely, lovely. Got anything else? Rifle rounds, sure, 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 sure. Normal arrows, yep, I'll take them too. I don't mind Excellent. this town being a little sleepy. Suits me fine. Yeah, beautiful spot. Beautiful spot. Strawberry's lovely. Ah. <sighs> Radio commercial for tear gas candles. Okay, you'll have to give me a minute. Radio commercials take a minute to prep. And I haven't done one in a while. Hello? You look hungry. No, not hungry. Not hungry. I've got a couple of bits and pieces for you. Got some fish. Just as popular how common it is. <laughs> some turtle eggs. I'm a dozen these days. Hey, look, you don't get many fucking tortoises and shit up here. Shut up. Lucky this is popular how common it is. Okay. Sell all of them. I'm <laughs> a dozen these days. Sell all of them. Done. Lucky Sell this is popular how common it is. Yeah, mate. All right. Well, enjoy working in the rain. Um, I'd be going to the pub if I were you, but all right. Pleasure doing business. Uh, okay. Yeah. Keep it moving. Well, now. Why, hello, miss. Spider sense is tingling. How do you do? Now, see, this is why I don't venture too far from the roads. I heard a man was pulled right off his horse by a grizzly bear. <laughs> That's just how it goes. Wow, well, no sympathy. Hmm. Quite. One thick moustache, it could stop a 44 or a 50. Yep, definitely. He's a... Uh, got a real butcher's moustache there. Not that that's a thing. Tear gas candles.
do you enjoy the way that hot sauce and onions make your eyes feel? Are you the type of person that thinks mayonnaise doesn't have enough kick? Do you think that that same thing can be applied to your candles that they just are too basic? Then try our new and improved tear gas candles. Testing them out as one of three new flavors. Find more in your candles aisle at your local supermarket. Tear gas candles. For those that enjoy a little spice in your life. Eh, could be better. Could be better. Not my best work. Ooh, I'll have that gun oil. Thank you very much. Uh, I don't need express rounds. I'll take the horse reviver though, thank you. We've got a hairbrush too, which is nice. Ooh, horse stimulant too. I'll have you. Uh, I think it's just the rifle rounds in there. So, don't need that. That can go away. If you load it, you're going to regret doing it. Yep. One of three new candle flavors, including wasabi, horseradish, and our extreme version, tear gas. Love that cigar, they always stash a cigar on top. My character's fucking short as shit, so she can't see it. Uh, I don't need open rifle cartridges. That's fine. They can keep them. I got plenty of rifle cartridges. Close this up like I was never here. Beautiful. Ben says me. I don't think I can open these. Oh no, I can. Hello, room. What you got for me here? Anything shiny? Snake oil? Mmm, nah, don't trust it. What's in the bottle? Ah, uh, fucks me. You should drink it, it'll make you feel better. But, so you know what's in it. Nah, but it looks alright. It smells pretty potent. My character has mild OCD, so they have to open up. Each side independently. Oh, I'll have that. Thank you. Love me some hair pomade. Uh, no, that's not anything. Search the drawers. <laughs> Tear gas, pepper spray, and our most painful, a nine bang. Yeah, it's literally just, it's just a flashbang grenade with a wick in it. An opened health cure? Fuck yeah. It gets extra bonuses because it's had someone's lips or it all over already. I can hear doors creaking. And they're not me. How are you? Love this little town. Love it. Anyway, this room can get fucked. I'm not closing everything for this. Open. Oh, someone's smart. They're locking doors. Smart cookies. Uh, thank you for your patronage. Not bad. Not bad. Hello. Hey, how you doing? Hello. I wave at you. Howdy. Ah, uh, she's friendly. Hello, random horse. Anybody in jail? Yeah. 
Nothing beats lighting a few spicy candles while enjoying your onion and salami flavored ice cream. Ugh. Gross. Uh, repeater cartridges. I don't use a repeater. Like, ever. What is in this drawer? What is in this drawer? <gasps> what is in this drawer? <gasps> what is in this drawer? Hmm. I see. Clock's ticking. I'm amazed that I'm in the jail just going through all this shit. I'll have those bitters though. Thank you. <laughs> you ever want to get flashbanged? No? Well, you're in luck with that new nine bang version. It doesn't flashbang you. Not once, not twice, not three times, but nine separate occasions. It puts the bang into bang, 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 bang. Oh. The fuck happened here? This is their gallows, but like... Fuck. Hello? Knock knock. Mm. Rosa Jones. Joe Powell. Oh, look at that. Whatever sketch artist drew that is a just champion at their job. The initiates. Eh. They never let me into the tavern here. I love the little creek that runs through the middle of town. Hey, Messi. Actually, the shop should be open by now. It's early enough. Welcome back. Well then, have a look. Hey, bud. Hmm. Credit abate. You don't want to go out there without it. Hmm. Probably would have helped with that bear before. Yeah, go on then. Let's have some of that. And yes, I'll have some coffee. Of course I will have some coffee. Biscuits. Uh... If you're looking for anything else, there's a catalog on the counter. Nags we wouldn't really mind a bottle of this. Well. Just in case. Why is it good to have a few bottles in your bag anyway? Sweet corn, peaches, baked beans. I wonder how many peaches are in here. They'll stay good Millions? On the road. Maybe millions of peaches. Peaches for me. Millions of peaches. Peaches for one dollar. Canned peas, how exciting. A pocket watch. I'm still too much of a tight ass to buy a pocket watch. It's only one gold bar, but... Always free to look at the catalog. Hmm. Is that the one? I don't know, man. I 
Maybe another time. No one else has bought it yet, so... What is this? Ah, oh, that's the hair pomade. Right, right. Live crickets. Beautiful. Live worms, lovely. Strawberry just ain't ready for this kind of change. Just not yet. The last a good while. Yeah, we'll get some crickets. You... We'll get some crickets. For our next fishing trip. I don't know how long they're gonna stay alive for if they're just in a tin and I don't open them for a month. Your internet went, you're back though. Welcome back. Solid meat, lovely, lovely. All right, well. Boy, I'll see I you later, shopkeeper. Coaster, tell me how quaint my Thank you very much. See you, bud. Is that doctor an actual doctor? Nah, he's not. He lies. Beautiful spot. What are my thoughts on F1? Um, they go really fast. They go meow like that. And that's very quick. I don't really have any thoughts on F1. They're good. We have a race here in uh, in Melbourne once a year. Um, it was here a couple of weeks ago. I didn't go, <laughs> but um, it's fine. Ooh, my spider sense is tingling. is it? Ooh, tarot card. Five of swords, hey? Hmm. Interesting. Five you. Here you go. Getting closer to all 14. Oh, the doctor's open. There's just no one here. Hello? Oh, maybe he's not open. You still doctor? Wait. Thought I heard another tingle in here for a second. Maybe I didn't. You never knew that? You'd love to go watch the Australian Grand Prix? Yeah, it's, a, it's in a pretty good spot. Like, I've seen it on TV. I've never been there myself. I've heard it, though. We're close enough that you can hear them off in the distance. And, um... They, uh, as part of it, they get jets to fly over the city. Which is loud as fuck! But it's pretty cool. It's pretty exciting. Hey mate, you said this place was for rent? Are you the one... No? Am I just talking to your hat? Alright then. I'll go fuck myself. One of the F1 drivers got a terminated contact for reason contract for reasons. Yeah, I feel like that sort of thing happens occasionally in any sport. Someone does something dumb and then... That's it, game over. But there's usually some company out there that is willing to look the other way and be like, oh, you can come do hey, some races careful. for us as long as you're on your best behavior. Oh. Mercy, go. 
Get out of here. Come on. Ah, yep. Fair enough. That's what they're saying. Yeah, I hear that that's not um not a popular thing to be at the moment. Yep. It's uh that's what they're saying. It's naughty. Apparently. It's not very good, no. No. It is not. It is not. Got hired for some work and they laid us off after just two days. Only paid us for one. Us labor has been duped. Yeah, that's about right. I ain't the first time. Just such a gorgeous game. Just so chill. You don't want to talk about it because it's sensitive to some people, so you'll stop now? Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. I mean, obviously, it's something that's taking over the world. Well, no, that's a poor choice of words. That's not what I meant. But it's something that is, is you know, uh, at the forefront of a lot of people's minds. And I like to keep this place pretty away from that, specifically. Give people a bit of a respite from it, I guess. Nothing against it being brought up. Obviously, it's something that's part of the world, but... Um, yeah. Today was only going to be a relatively short day. But, uh,. We carried on. I can feel my voice going from me a little bit. But it's still here. Now I hope everyone has enjoyed their day today. I do want to thank Lucky3381 for the follow. I want to thank Wingers and Lord Sarvain uh, for the gift subs that went out to... Snorf and DJ Mac. It's very, very kind of you two. How long have I been live? Uh, I don't know exactly. Nearly three hours, I think. Not very long. Not very long for me, at least. Anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm used to you know six or more or whatever it may be, just because that's what I used to put in. But I just um, I've been a little bit under the weather recently, so I figured doing a a shorter sort of mosey stream today would be a bit better. You can't go live for like one hour without being bored. Yeah, you just got to find things that entertain you then, I guess. Find things that work for you. You have fun with. Okay. Things is bad for old Joe. You don't even have a tail feather left. Mm. Bear with me for just a second.
what we might do. We might go and we'll go drop by Claire. Oh, perfect timing because my controller batteries have just come up so that they're low as well. So that's almost like it's meant to be. We'll go, we'll drop by Claire. It looks as though she's currently playing Lost in Random, which is currently on Game Pass. I haven't played it myself. Looks like a game where the world is built around dice rolls. Um, looks like fun. Looks like a cute little game. But we'll jump over there and say g'day. Stick around for the raid. Share the love. And uh, if you haven't joined the Discord, Join the Discord. You know where it is. You know how to get there. And also, this VOD's going to go up on YouTube in the uh, Mosing With My Eyes Sleeping playlist. But I'll, uh, I will talk to you all again. Hope everyone's had a great day. I will talk to you soon. Have an awesome tomorrow. See ya. And for anybody that's sticking around, or that's been left behind for the raid, or that's watching the VOD after the fact, you're awesome too. And whether you're watching this tomorrow, a week from now, a year, ten years, or long after I'm gone, stay awesome. Howdy. And I'm sure you'll hear from me again. See ya.